for another day at the Whitewater Center, but today is different. Today is Tuck Fest. What up? I feel like I probably should. I rolled! I flipped and rolled! Like I was going over, I was like, you know what? Let me just commit to going over. Combat rolls! Let's go! I like your helmet. Thank you. Thanks, appreciate it. First solid lap of Tug Fest. We got all the vendors up here. Yeah. So far, so good. Let's get another lap in. Woo! Let's go. Lap two at Techfest. No swims, no flips that time. I think we're about to go check out some of the vendor booths in just a minute here. I think I ate my words about the weather. It's taking quite a turn, so I'm gonna try to get one more lap in before the rain really sets in. Unfortunately, I swam that lap on M Wave. Felt like I couldn't get a paddle in where I wanted to. And I'm gonna swap this GoPro battery out, and then we're gonna put on right here and run M Wave again because I'm better than that. Let's try this again. The rain stopped, it's cleared up, and uh, let's not swim this time. All right. Stop recording. We're now heading over to go watch some, what's it called, Sam? Deep Water Solo. Deep Water Solo. Yeah. Let's put on for another afternoon lap. You know, I am just now about to come up on my year anniversary of paddling. I started paddling in May of 2022, and uh, it feels pretty nice to be able to like run down the channel by myself and like just enjoy and not have to like feel like I need someone else to like show me down or be there if I swim I can kind of like self-rescue and I'm getting more comfortable with my role so I know everyone progresses at a different time and um, some people progress much faster than a year and some people are still working on stuff a year and it's turned out to be a pretty amazing day weather-wise and uh, yeah let's send it. about feeling good out here? How lame. We are better. We are tired. But we are better. We are better. Bum, ba, dum, bum, 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 bum. Too bad all of YouTube is gonna see. Okay. Maybe we do one more lap and then we swell because we <coughs> and here I was 
thinking. but I didn't even see that the conveyor belt was turned off. So I guess I'm hiking my boat back out. I'm gonna take this up to the car and stuff and get my clothes yeah, I so I change. I'm beat. I am a beat. If you go ahead and unroll the window, I'll slide this in. <laughs> I lost all my strength. Yeah, I can give you a hand No. <laughs> I got no more strength. I know, it's okay. I got tired. It's okay. Okay, I'm tired. I'm tired of the grandpa. That was too many laps. What's even more unfortunate is like before I put on the last two laps, I did this talking thing to the camera and I was like, yeah, I feel pretty good. I gotta put my hat on. I was saying I felt really good that I could paddle by myself and do all the things. And then I swam the last two laps right after that. So I don't think I can do all the things. I mean, swimming is part of all the things. This is still recording. We are wrapping up a fun-filled day at the Whitewater Center. Got our kayaking in, got our activities in, and now we're about to go enjoy some live music. We're gonna go check out Moon Taxi. Okay guys, there were just a few things that I wanted to talk about from what was technically last weekend at Tuckfest. There were a few things that I wanted to just touch base on after watching back some of my footage. And the first thing was that I kind of technically hit my first like real combat role. It felt really good to finally feel like, hey, I've progressed in my rolling. I spent a lot of time practicing the Wednesday before Tuckfest out here, just really trying to solidify my role. Everyone's at different stages in their paddling, and it felt really good to me to finally hit that combat role. There were several roles that I missed. There was a lot pushier water in the other places that I flipped, and you know, I paddled a lot of laps, and I was out here all day in the sun, and when you're still new, like, you get tired. Sometimes that's what it's all about. It's just working through things until you can nail them, like doing reps in the gym. And I felt like I was really out here on Saturday, like running rep after rep after rep or lap after lap after lap. And, you know, really just pushing myself to see like what waves I could roll up in or couldn't roll up in and seeing like where I really needed to put more work in. So 
yeah, I just wanted to touch on those things and talk about how stoked I was to hit my roll, even though I may have ended the day on a little bit of a bus of swims, but you know, that just is what it is. If there's someone walking up, I'm gonna stop now. Anyways, I just wanted to touch on those few things and highlight those as um, kind of key points in my day and in my paddling career. And uh, thanks for coming along the journey with me.